Take a look at this video of Japanese Prime Minister Fumio Kishida tucking into squid from Fukushima Prefecture. His fish market appearance was among many steps the government has taken to try and reassure the world that it is perfectly safe for Japan to release treated radioactive water into the ocean from the tsunami-wrecked Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant. Getting that message across has been an uphill battle. Governments and residents in countries near Japan, including China and South Korea, have loudly protested against the tainted water release. Even though the UN's International Atomic Energy Agency has said the radiological impact on people and the environment is negligible. So what is the science behind the controversy, and how much do we know about whether the water release is really safe? It is actually a common practice for nuclear power plants to discharge wastewater into the sea. Nuclear plants in China, as well as the U.S., are known to carry out the practice. The Tokyo Electric Power Company, which runs the Fukushima plant, says the release includes water used to cool debris from three reactors that melted down after an earthquake and tsunami hit the facility, as well as groundwater that has been contaminated since the 2011 disaster. According to a Hong Kong-based scientist and mechanical engineer, the liquid stored in Fukushima is very different from coolant water routinely released in other countries. For the uh, um, uh, normal so like, um, uh, power plant operation, uh, they will generate some uh, wastewater, but those water is not, uh, does not actually uh, get in touch with the damaged core. What Fukushima uh, wastewater is different from the um, uh, uh, ordinary um, you know, nuclear power plant is that the water generated from Fukushima um, uh, Daiichi nuclear power plant uh, actually uh, is, uh, uh, flows through the um, damaged core. So in the water, it, it is contaminated with over 60 uh, different types of um, uh, radionuclei. And uh, some of them uh, have a very uh, long half-life. Before being dumped into the sea, the contaminated water at Fukushima goes through a filter called the Advanced Liquid Processing System. Japan's nuclear agency says that after using this method, the only significant contaminant left is tritium. So what is tritium? It's a radioactive isotope of hydrogen that can be naturally formed in the upper atmosphere, but it is also a common byproduct of nuclear power generation. Tritiated water is one of the key issues at the heart of the dispute about what is happening in Fukushima. In small amounts, tritium is considered relatively harmless. Worldwide, there are many nuclear power plants and the reprocessing unit. Then uh, routinely, they release the tritium water into the ocean uh, by complying the regulation level. Then uh, this already, you know, continues more than 40 years, even 50 years. But according to the Canadian Nuclear Safety Commission, tritium ingested above certain levels can increase the risk of cancer. The severity of contamination is often measured in becquerels, one of the most common units for measuring radioactivity. Japan has said it plans to release 22 trillion becquerels of tritium per year with the treated Fukushima wastewater. A report from Japan's Ministry of Economy, Trade and Industry shows the Yangjiang nuclear power station in China's Guangdong province released 112 trillion becquerels of tritium in 2021. The Heishim-2 nuclear power station in the UK released about 323 trillion becquerels of tritium in 2020. And the Bruce nuclear generating station in Canada discharged around 1,090 trillion becquerels of tritium in 2021. That is around 50 times the amount Japan plans to release per year at the Fukushima plant. Since tritiated water is routinely released from nuclear power facilities into the sea, is the tritium discharge in Fukushima's case different from what happens at other plants? According to many scientists, including Professor Hibiki, the answer is no. This means that somebody uh, worry about a long-term effect because Fukushima a treating water would be released for next 30 years. But actually, we already have experience. More than 40 years, we continuously release the uh, uh, treating water into the ocean. 
but uh, no health hazards due to the uh, uh, tritium has been reported. So uh, this can be the scientific fact. Japanese authorities said they would dilute the water until the tritium level was below 1,500 becquerels per liter. That is far below the World Health Organization's recommended standard of 10,000 becquerels per liter for drinking water. When the arbitrated water, diluted arbitrated water is released into the ocean, then a, um, a tritium level around the ocean may not be affected. So they already start releasing the uh, diluted arbitrated water, then they already measured what's the impact. Then uh, no uh, below the detective range. So substantially, you know, negative effect is, is uh, imposed to the uh, environment. Despite the endorsement of the UN watchdog, there have been protests and opposition voiced in Japan and overseas. Some experts questioned the impartiality of data reported by the Japanese nuclear plant operator and have called for independent assessments. The whole uh, sample taking is actually done by TEPCO, and TEPCO only gives the samples to um, IAEA for uh, benchmark uh, for benchmarking. So, so if the sample is, is not correct, then obviously the benchmarking become meaningless. So uh, as, that's why um, um, in Hong Kong we, we are we are worried that you know uh, whether TEPCO can can do the job properly. Uh, um, whether we should have a, a third party uh, independent uh, uh, center or independent uh, uh, research body that can actually uh, carry out the, uh, the sampling, the test, uh, you know, on site to ensure, uh, you know, um, um, the whole process is, uh, uh, is credible. On the diplomatic front, China has consistently been among the most vocal opponents of the release. We the debate over the safety of the water release has also led to various bans on seafood from Japan in South Korea, mainland China, and Hong Kong. That has prompted the Japanese government to set aside 20 billion yen to support the fishing industry after China's import ban. For residents and business owners in Fukushima, however, there is still great concern that no matter how reassuring the answers are from the government or scientists, the damage to Fukushima's reputation will remain. Now, as the water flows from the crippled plant, many fear the legacy of radioactive contamination will haunt the community for years to come. ジョバモノという